Yeah, so we're in the bathroom of Seven Stars, which is yet another bar off of the San Carlos Strip. San Carlos has got the, uh, the 49ers, it has the Pink Pool, it has the Bears, it has the Seven Stars, it has the Red Star, uh, Red Stack Lounge. Uh, so there's a lot of dive bars all in a row. This one is probably the most trendy, youngest, um, and it, it reflects. So they have a, a pretty progressive uh, karaoke, and it's a younger crowd. Uh, so we'll take a look at it as soon as we uh, zip up here. The entrance to the Seven Stars Bar, the alternative entrance, as you can see, it's, uh, it's a bit of a nerd theme, Star Wars. It works. They have a very good crowd that spends well compared to the other dive bars on San Carlos. These guys are actually managed professionally and they will probably be around. Uh, the other dive bars are exactly that, dive bars. Seven Stars is a good place if you're in your 20-somethings or 30-somethings. We'll find out whether or not it's any good for us middle-aged barflies. Uh, it's worth mentioning that the, uh, sorry. Yeah, it's worth mentioning that the Seven Stars has off-street parking. Uh, it fills up. It can hold maybe about 30 cars, 25 maybe. Uh, but it is nice. It's an off-street uh, backside. It's the best parking lot of all the dive bars uh, in the San Carlos area. So uh, your car is safe here. It's, it's off the street. And uh, we will go in and check out the action. <laughs> I think this is missing uh, Princess Leia. Hey, so Santa Cruz Batman here. Uh, so this is kind of a private video. Uh, we're so we've been checking out all the dive bars, the famous bars along San Carlos Avenue, which is just uh, west of uh, you know straight out of downtown San Jose. Um, there's a place called Renegades. Renegades is listed as a as a gay bar, and uh, I haven't visited any of the gay bars in San Jose. Uh, they tend to have uh, very good drinks and very good atmosphere, and it's it's good to know that community uh, as I normally do. So, um, so let's explore Renegades and see uh, what kind of clientele we have there. Hey, so. Welcome to the Bamboo Lounge in San Jose. The Bamboo Lounge is known, uh, you know, if you officially search for gay bars in San Jose, you'll find Bamboo Lounge listed. It's far from a hardcore gay bar, it's more of a crossover bar. Excellent karaoke, excellent service, excellent drinks. It really is a, it's a nice place, uh, the crossover between dive bars and uh, working professional in Silicon Valley. Uh, so we're gonna close out of this men's bathroom here, which is not actually a men's bathroom, it's a uh, unisex. Since this is a uh, considered someone of a gay bar, the, uh, the whole controversy about what sex you are and what bathroom is completely diffused when the only bathrooms listed both doors are uh, unisex. So, uh, Next, we'll cut to the dance floor. Okay, cut to the dance floor, and uh, I'm trying to be subtle. Some people don't like to be videotaped. In the end, it's all good, though.
Cruz Batman reported from the Bamboo Lounge in San Jose. Over and out.